hello you guys good morning welcome back to another vlog i just got a facial that's why my skin might be looking um the way that it's looking i just got out of a facial and my skin feels so good it's so sunny today i'm so happy i'm just like in such a good mood and yeah i decided that i just was gonna do a little date daily vlog um and bring you guys along the day i don't know i haven't i feel like vlogged in a little bit so i'm excited to be vlogging today so welcome back to another vlog i am actually going to go pick up my brother from the airport right now so i have to go do that i <laughs> luckily i got a coffee before my facial i went to blue bottle and picked up a cold brew and it's 18 degrees today and my coffee is like still cold from before like two hours later so cheers to that i'm gonna go pick up my brother but i just wanted to say hello good morning and yeah <laughs> hi guys i just got done with my workout oh i'm literally like i haven't vlogged since yesterday i started off the vlog and then you guys saw like I went to my facial and I picked my brother up and then the rest of the day like I didn't pick up my camera oh I need to turn my car on um and I didn't pick up my camera for the rest of the day because I was just feeling like so overwhelmed and like anxious and I just got done with my workout and this morning like I wasn't even gonna go because I'm by myself I was not here and I was like maybe I should just take the day off um, and like focus on I don't know like sleep in and rest and like recharge and whatever But then I realized just like how much working out helps my mental health and just like helps me Like release stress and like stuff like that and um, I worked out with Mike and then we were like talking and stuff and he was like basically just told me like take care of yourself and um, make sure that you like make yourself a priority and like how you're feeling and stuff like that and he was like because you can't pour from an empty cup and i was like walking out and i was like that's so true i'm just like oh it's literally so true and i just i don't know i wasn't even gonna pick up like take out my camera right now and vlog or say anything but um i just really wanted to like share this side of my life because i feel like everything i do post online is always just like the best parts of my life and I've just been like going through so much since the start of this year that I know like some of you guys can tell like I haven't been as consistent with posting and vlogging especially just because some days I just feel like I like can't do anything like I don't want to do anything and all I want to do is just like lay in bed and just like um, <laughs> so I just wanted to let you guys know that if you're going through anything, you will get through it and you're all so strong, like so much stronger than you know, and everything in life happens for you, not to you. I always try to like remind myself that and like with whatever you're going through, I always like make it a point to remember that like I'm gonna learn so much in whatever situation I'm dealing with Like even if it's hard, that's just what I wanted to say this morning. I want to order a coffee <laughs> But I don't know if I should because I literally bought this like big thing of blue bottle yesterday And I have it at home, but there's just something about like going there and getting a coffee and then like making it which is just so good i think i'm gonna do that <laughs> i think i'm gonna go get one hey guys i got my coffee i got a cold brew just a black cold brew um i usually get oat milk but i've been like trying to just if i get coffee out i've been just getting black because um i like got obsessed with oat milk but I just don't know what type of oat milk that these places use and I've been reading a bunch of stuff about just how like all of the added like gums and ingredients in 
the non-dairy milks affect your hormones and that's something that I'm just like trying to get in check like my hormones are so out of whack <laughs> and I have been like trying to fix them for like a year and it's been definitely like a journey but it affects my skin so much and that also affects like how I feel and all that so I just got a black coffee I might add a little bit of oat milk in when I get home I have this brand at home it's called Malk and it, it literally has like two or three ingredients like just oats water and sea salt so yeah that's something that I'm like working on because my skin um, has been a struggle of mine for the past honestly like two years I changed my diet almost two years ago and the way that I was eating before like really messed up my hormones like I started to get cystic acne and I had never experienced that before I just got ready I am gonna go run some errands that I need to run today like really bad I've been putting them off for way too long and today's the day I just like need to get everything done so I just got ready also sorry if Milo um, barks if he hears me talking like he'll want to get out of his crate even though I just like put him in because he knows I'm leaving soon so put him in his crate so I can go run errands. Um, and if he barks, I'm sorry. <laughs> so anyway, I just got this big box in the mail. I'm, I sneak, I did a little like sneak peek, looked around in it, but I am partnering with Afterpay on this video, which I'm so excited about. And I'll explain what Afterpay is a little bit before I do an unboxing. You guys have probably heard of it before. They have it on different websites. Like you can buy now, like pay later type thing. So basically, what you can do is buy a product and then you pay in four different like interest-free installments. So for example, if you buy a product that's say $200, you pay $50 up front and once you pay that like upfront amount, your item ships to you and then every two weeks you just pay an interest-free amount. So you pay like $50 two weeks later and then so on and so forth. So it's really nice and they have like thousands of your favorite brands and products that you can buy so they sent me a PR box I'm so excited it has so many amazing beauty products inside and I really can't wait because some of these are like so nostalgic and my favorite from the past um, but yeah let's get into the unboxing first thing I saw is some Fenty skin you guys Rihanna is an icon we have some Fenty skin little looks like travel size the cleanser, um, the fat water, and the Hydra Visor, which is a hydration, like, moisturizer with sunscreen, which is really cool. Love that. Then also the Ole Hendrickson Banana Bright Vitamin C Serum, the Truth Serum. This serum was my favorite a few years ago. This is, like, a nice, big, full size. These are pretty pricey, but... This serum, I remember I used to use that. And then next we have the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask. This mask smells just like watermelons. I remember when this came out, like me and my friends would freak out about it because it just like smelled so good and felt so like good and soothing on your face. And then also got some hair products by Verb. The Ghost Oil Smoothing Moringa Blend Weightless Hair Oil and the Leave In Mist which looks like it's like a detangler, defrizz, conditioner, um, cute little, so like when you get out of the shower, I don't know about you guys, but when I get out of the shower, I like brush my hair and I feel like I'm like ripping the brush through my hair. It gets so like tangled when I take a shower. So I like to use like a wet brush and 
I've been wanting to get a new like detangler like spray to spray in my hair after I shower So this will be perfect it hydrates smooths repairs ends detangles strengthens adds shine preps for styling nourishes tames frizz prevents breakage does so much I feel like when I cut my hair short I cut my hair short like two months ago I started to get really into hair products and I love using like oils and hair masks and stuff like this so I'm really excited to try these out and then I also got a little cute bandana this is like blue green like a blue and green ombre and then i got some makeup products that i already dug into the first one is this lip product it is the bite beauty plumping lip gloss and cider donut i have a few of these already that i've bought and they're really really good i love the formula i love how they make my lips feel like they make them feel juicy and hydrated and, they, and it doesn't dry out your lips and this shade is like a really nice kind of looks like what the lip stain i have on my lips right now it's like a little bit darker than my natural lip color i just feel like it adds like a nice like warmth to your lips and i don't know just gives like a little bit of life i like how it has a shimmer too it'd be cute for like a nighttime look and next we have the anastasia beverly hills lash brag voluming mascara whoa Look at that applicator, you guys. Love. I love that. I can't wait to try this. The um, packaging is really nice, too. It's, like, very heavy. I don't know. It just feels, like, luxurious. <laughs> and then next, I already swatched this on my hand. I don't know if you guys can see. But it's, like, a beautiful rose gold eyeshadow crayon by Laura Mercier. You know, cute little... Just adds, like... A nice shimmer when you don't want to really do too much but you want to add like a little something something this would be perfect for like a natural makeup look i can't wait to use this in the summertime i love laura mercier and then last but not least my favorite product which i'm so excited about this brings back so many memories i used to use this gloss right when it came out like 2017 when i was in college the fenty beauty fenty glow gloss bomb this thing you guys so good i love like the smell of it it just smells so good and look at that applicator it's like a nice thick thick applicator and this gloss like doesn't dry out your lips it makes them feel super hydrated as well so yeah all of these products were like really 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 good i hit the jackpot on this one like i'm obsessed with all of these i can't wait to especially use the makeup products I am gonna play around with them this weekend and I'm gonna be vlogging this weekend like I'll do a weekend vlog So stay tuned for that to see how I use these products and um, I'm really excited before I leave I just wanted to mention to you guys that after payday is coming up on March 25th to 28th 2021 you guys don't want to miss it. So set a reminder download their app. I'll leave a link down below you guys can shop their sale there's going to be so many amazing sales on like thousands of your favorite brands and products so you definitely want to check that out i'll leave a link down below so yeah thank you afterpay for sponsoring this video i'm so excited to use my new beauty products i just got to newberry street and it is popping off today like literally popping off there's so many people outside but I found a spot. I need to get lunch. I just wanted to get out of the house today. And I didn't really have anything to make. Since it's Friday. Like it's the end of the week for my groceries. Um, so yeah. I'm going to get some lunch. I'm thinking of going to a restaurant and like sitting by myself. <laughs> and just getting a table for one. Because it's hard. Like all the cafes and places I like to go to. Here only have takeout like you can only get takeout and i want to be able to sit down and eat there and you can't do that at tata i was really craving like avocado toast but can't have that today you can't have everything you know so i think i'm gonna go get thai food and yeah <laughs> i'm excited i haven't had thai food in a while and this is like the only restaurant like i just want a restaurant also that's like quiet 
So here we go. So I hey, I'm back. I'm back home. Oh, busy, busy day. Like Newberry Street was packed. And I returned a bunch of stuff at Zara that I needed to return. Um, what else did I do? I, oh, I got a bunch of new candles today, which I'm really excited about because I have been wanting to get new, like, spring scents for the apartment. And I didn't really know, like, which candles to get. I feel like... It's hard to order candles online, and I was gonna get some dip tea candles, but the scent that I wanted was sold out. So I obviously didn't order those. So I ran into Anthropology because it's across the street from Zara. These are the candles that I got. I got the Volu Spa. Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> I just don't know how to pronounce this brand, but I really love this brand of candles. They're so good. I got the Cantaloupe Hibiscus, and then this other big one over here is like a lime scented one, and then this one is Italian Bellini. This one is called Laguna. And this one's called Crisp Champagne. And then I got this really cute, just like little orange glass jar which i thought would be really cute for like jewelry um i could put like my watch in it and my soli rings and stuff like that so that's really cute and i just love the color is going on right now and also the detailing of these candles like the glass is just like stunning i um just realized now that i can save them once the candles are all burnt and like use them as like little containers which is really cute like this would look so cute in the bathroom and then these little ones right here i think are really cute like how cute would that be with um yeah i don't know <laughs> but they're just really cute so let's check the prices the big one is only 30 dollars, so i got all these candles and it was under 100 dollars and that's crazy these are 18 so they're really well priced and the scents are really nice and i remember from what i remember they burn pretty nicely as well they last a pretty long time um they smell really good they're not too overpowering so yeah i'm excited that i got these hi little miss <laughs> wait my camera's like flipped hi okay also guys when i was out i got the cacti i was gonna like do a little taste test right now because I was going to do one for the vlog anyway, but Emma was just asking me about them. How do I even open this thing? You want one? You want a cacti? 70% alcohol. Yeah. How much is a White Claw? How much that is. Huh? <laughs> how much is a White Claw? What the fuck does that mean? 70%? Should we get 100? Y'all, how much is a White Claw? Like plus five. Oh. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, this box. <laughs> yo, yo. Enough of that. Bless you. Enough of that. <sighs> um, so what flavor should I try first? We have strawberry. Lime. Lime. Mm, pineapple. And lime. Yeah, boy. Okay. You want some? <laughs> like pour it over ice in a cup. Yeah, do that. I'm gonna because, um, yeah, I just feel like, I feel like that's what I gotta do around here. Okay, here we go. We have lime. Ooh. It smells like something I've smelled before. Let me try. It was just 
Oh my god. <laughs> Wait. Wait, these are fire. Someone said that the pineapple one tastes like he went on the three mile run and bottled his butt sweat. Ew, really? I like the lime. I don't know. Okay. We have. I'm gonna try the pineapple. <laughs> Smells good. Get it all. Stir around. It's not bad. It's not bad. I can definitely. She likes the taste of some wet, some wetty butt. <laughs> See, like, like the aftertaste tastes like a cracker. Like, I think beer tastes like crackers. It kind of tastes like beer after. Strawberry, you guys. Ooh, baby. The strawberry is really good. The strawberry is really good. Okay, honestly, I'd have to rate the strawberry... Strawberry is 10 out of 10, lime is 10 out of 10, pineapple is like a 6 out of 10. <laughs> but I really like these. I like them better than White Claws. Yeah. You hear that, Liv? It's better than a White Claw. Literally, like, every color. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry, my nose was okay because I was outside and I went on a walk and I, like, touched my eyes and there's, like, dust. Not dust, but, like... Yeah, I know what you mean. But... Cute. So to dinner, and I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. I'm wearing these jeans from Heavy Manners with these really cute, um, like net heels, and I have on this Orson and Iris little top. My orange bag from JW, JWP, JW Free. I I don't know how to pronounce it, but anyway, orange solely, orange bag, all white outfit. You guys will see it in my spring haul. <laughs> Draga! Calamari. I don't know what this is, but it looks really good. Nice little salad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, everybody. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to the vlog.